You've just hit a bullseye. Welcome back. It's your Feel Good Breakfast Show Express on Live. And it gives me a huge amount of pleasure to welcome Devin Peterson, Thanks our top ranked <laughs> darts player in the country. And when I heard your nickname, the Spartan, I saw the tattoos and the size of the man. I was thinking maybe we were in the MMA territory. <laughs> um, but you, you obviously have a, a huge amount of prestige attached to you, as I understand it being Africa's only professionally ranked darts player, 50th in the world, which is no mean feat. What, what made you take this on as a career? You've, you've taken this to, to that, that level now. Yeah, that's, that's correct. My dad used to play when he was 12 and, and obviously growing up with darts was in the family. And I just thought um, I played football as well. And I didn't see a big future for myself in football uh, because it was a 10 year span that you had. And I thought, well, I'm going to live a lot longer than that. And then I took up darts. And funny enough, it was, it was like taking like a duck to water, basically. Uh, I've seen you throw a few. And even at this, uh, this is probably the earliest you've ever thrown a dart, I have to assume, unless a tournament has gone right through the night. Uh, South Africans, I don't think, realize how big darts is globally. What is preventing South Africans from taking that step up? How come you're the, the lone shining light? I think the, the sport itself has, has, has very little or almost no media exposure. And um, with, with what we're doing and the ventures that we're busy doing now, we, we're trying to create a lot more immediate exposure so that we can have the next Devin Peterson coming out from the, the schooling academies that we, we're planning to host as well. So there's, it's, it's, a very hard, it's, a, it's a very hard tournament as well, or, or the season itself, because yeah, you're playing against grueling, the, the best 128 players um, in, at, from around the world. So it's not been easy, but um, you know, like, like everything else, um, nothing worthwhile comes easy. Well, that's exactly it. You've just painted a, a bit of a bullseye on your back now if you want the, the youngsters to come up and take you on. So, ah, in the spirit of Express, so I'm going to take you on. So I'm going to ask you to give me a little bit of a lesson here. Um, take me through some of the do's and don'ts okay. of darts. And um, we've mapped out, obviously, our little correct distance here. Um, and we've got our darts board. So let's step up and you okay, can show cool. me how the pros do it. So, so what, what do I need to take okay, into so, account when I'm throwing So it first thing is, is when you're setting up, right, um, it's, it's always great to align your, the center of your body with a bullseye. So darts is a very, it's based on, based on your comfortability. So some people throw from the right of the, arc of the line, some people throw from the left. So when you're setting up, it's very, it's very important to have a sturdy base. So from your, from your bottom. So when you're setting up, the, the front foot is obviously Straight That's under the anchor, back foot, yeah. yeah, yeah, just to give you a bit of leverage. And then setting up the, the dart itself, it's a, you'll see that most of the time it's a 90 degree action because if you're throwing like this, you're gonna need power. So your power comes from the, from like a catapult, basically, <laughs> correct. All right. Um, and then obviously comfortability based on your grip. So your, 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 your setup would be, a, would be just a straight throw. Well, it's very Ooh. early morning, so I'm just... Um, <laughs> Start. That's, oh, that's a trip. Oh, that's <laughs> so that's, that's basically, basically the one. That's how we do it. So, all yeah. right, so are you ready to take me on? <clears throat> um, yeah, are we, what are we doing? Arm do wrestling. Let's do it. Let's start, do it. So. <laughs> um, we're going to start in the, the Greco Roman position on the, on the mat. Okay, so I'm ready. So I've got my, my base is nice and strong. Correct, yeah. We're going to start at a nice 90 degree angle. You're an absolute Ooh. natural, aren't you? You've done this Ooh. before. Oh, come on. It feels weird without a, a drink in this hand. Though, <laughs> Oh, that's bad. So Talking what's that? about a 20? glass of water, milk, coke, because we don't, we don't actually <laughs> indulge in, be in beverages. All right, yeah. so that's what? 31, 32. All right, yeah. 32 is the number to beat. Come on, do your, do your you? trade okay, proud, cool. my friend. Do your trade 32, proud. 32, that's a pleasure, that. Come on, man. Oh, yeah. sorry. You want to wear anyone to boom, yeah. and that's how you do it as a pro. Um, we're going we're gonna to keep um, Devin around just a little bit longer this morning and get, hopefully get a, a few more demos out of him. But, dude, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Thanks a lot for having um, me. I know you're going to be putting on a show at Last Man Standing at Grand West Arena this weekend, so hopefully we can welcome in that new generation, okay, man. Brilliant. I, I think we need another round. I think we need another <laughs> round. Let's hear from some of those little greats, Ewan.